Hi, trainer Emily here, and this is Jolene, and welcome to Training Tip Tuesday. This week we continue our series on new tips for old dogs, and Jolene's gonna help us today a little bit with uh, some ideas for games to play with your older dog. So a lot of people think about older dogs as um, not terribly sharp, and they can't play games the same way that younger dogs do. They can't do as much running and things like that. So they're not gonna play tag so well, but it is important to keep your dog's mind sharp. They're still plenty capable of thinking and solving problems, even though it might take them a minute longer. And generally, while their hearing and sight will sometimes go, their sense of smell is usually, usually the last to go, simply because it's so important to the dog. One of my favorite games to play with older dogs is the shell pot game. So it's kind of a, a new twist on the walnut shell game. You get some flower pots and you start out with them facing up. And then you put Treats in one, while the dog isn't looking, don't look. Okay. <gasps> Jolene, look. What's it? So you encourage the dog to smell in the pots, and when she finds the one with the treats, <gasps> where is it? Is it there? Yeah, good girl. These are a little narrow, so she can't quite eat out of them. So I'll dump the treats out for her. So that encourages her to look for treats in pots and get her started on that. Then when the dog is doing it a little more consistently, you can flip the pots over. Because the neat thing about flower pots is they already have a hole built in the middle of them. So the dog can smell the treats through the hole. And when they find them, good job! It doesn't require a lot of moving around, so it's really good for older dogs, and yet it still keeps their mind sharp. There's a lot of studies about age and longevity in people that show that um, human beings who um, are mentally stimulated into their old age and learn new things and, and keep their mind sharp actually live longer and live healthier lives towards the end. And while the studies on dogs are a little bit more limited in terms of that, there's no reason to believe that that wouldn't be so. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next week.